time. And as a result, Cowboys turned it into points. Now to kick off for the first time is Dan Bailey. This is a little bit different for Oklahoma State. Quinn Sharp, also the punter, the normal kickoff man, led the nation in touchbacks. This one will be returned by Travis Cobb. Travis Cobb has running room only Bailey. Inside the 35. That is weird. Nick Foles, the Texas native, who's the coordinators, Bill Biedenbaugh and Seth Luttrell. His field goals won't beat a team averaging 45 points. Did really well in practice. They're much smoother, and he's ready, you know, for this game, and they're ready to go. So we'll see how that carries over right now. Question of the kicker, Alex and Deos's confidence after having two extra points blocked. <laughs> you think? Yes, Arizona State. <laughs> yeah. Made the grab, so Arizona will have it for the CF. What do you think about that? That'll be a good one to lead into South Balls. Good pickup on first, the second and two. We've talked about Oklahoma State's offense, this pass offense in the top ten in the nation. Capable of putting up points quickly. Able to rehab, come back, and play at the level he's played all conference. That's an incredible story. Full tilt. Uh, no one wants to take the aggressiveness out of the game, but I think that one was a proper call by David. Al Quinn tonight, number 76. Been watching him so far, doing a heck of a job, but that's such an important. Seth Luttrell going to the quick game, getting the football out of Nick Foles' hands early so that Kyle Quinn at center can get established a little bit, not put too much to Douglas. That's Nick Foles' roommate. Played his first two seasons out wide. They moved him into the slot this year, doing a nice job finding the soft spot of his own. Back the Reds on one of the worst teams in the country there, not taking the little two and three yard gain like Jesse just showed you. That is the advantage of having a big physical receiver on the outside. Bronner stands six foot four. He's able to use his body. Territorial cup that we saw. A couple of block points cost him in double overtime. And as a result, Arizona now hasn't won a game since October. Take a look at that. It seemed to me like a lot of these guys got over it a lot faster than I think we would have assumed. He gave the team three days away. They regrouped. He came in and sealed it. And if you let Grigsby get a little run in space, he's going to find it. And he'll run past your arms. This offense is completely different when he's close to healthy, and this coaching staff hopes that he's close to 100. Not able to get that football out on time. That allowed Markel Martin to make a play on it and set up another third and long. Guy that's behind the starter to step in and play. His football team has met that challenge. Trying to answer first play of the second quarter will be a second and 14. Cats have it on their own 16-yard line. Not that kind of guy. He wants to play close to the vest. Does not want to send a lot of guys in pressure. He likes to keep everything in front of him. He is 14th catch of the season. Well, again, you get the loose look on the defensive line. Only three. They're standing up. First down. He's wrestled out of bounds by Broderick Brown. This is a very multiple offense for Arizona. They can spray heels. And this offense clicks the most. And, and you know what? That's like a run right there. That's a big toss sweep, isn't it? But he threw a catchable ball. A ball that let his receiver get up the field. In this play, they handed it off, and they pitched it back too soon. And if you watch the wide receivers downfield, Foles has the football back in his hands too early. And it does not fool the secondary. Well, and usually you have a running game. Touchdown, Oklahoma State. A 61-yard pick six. The 17th interception of the season for Oklahoma State. It's up 13, 13 and change to go in the game. Trying to get to 12 and 0, okay? Defense gives up 276 yards a game. That's six words in the country. But they are opportunistic. Look at the 32 turnovers that picked by Mark. Again, a symbol of their football season. They just can't finish and make plays when they're there. You just saw the expression on Mike Stoops' face. It's just when they don't make a play. On the defense, number 95. That penalty is declined. Results of the play. First down. In college football with parity like it is. And the misses that we just saw earlier. Then you, you talk about a Lou and I. I mean, two and I. Backs his team up five. And now the hill is even greater for Arizona. 
So Douglas makes the 13 yard grab on third and 12, keeping the drive alive for Mike Stoops offense. Seeing another example of the power running game here from Arizona. Bill Young told us the good news was is Oklahoma, the last team that Oklahoma State. And a lot of pressure. It's a very quick Oklahoma State defensive line. Donaldson was working against right tackle Philip Garcia there, who comes into this game with a bit of a knee injury. Really punts it away, the sure-handed. Douglas back there. To it's on the, on the right slide in the slot, working a corner route. The throw has to come out right now. He tried to pump fake outside to make the corner bite. But for, if nothing else, you have to recognize and respect the closing speed of this Oklahoma State secondary. They're fast. I mean, Bill Young's got speed up front. He's got a version for the Cats. There's your manufacturing, Jesse. I was looking for the button run or, you know, hit and steal or something like that. But, but this is how you do it because Nick Foles, while he gets up in the field, do these things. Your football team. Personal foul. Force collar tackle on the defense. Number 41. A penalty is 15 yards. The middle of the field. Kreiner had the drop, right, in the middle of the field because in the flats. Arizona will back it up five. You see the frustration from Mike Stoops. And we've talked about the struggles Arizona has had this year in the red zone. Well, that's one of the reasons. Great job just going up, trying to high point the football, knock it away. That's the risk you take. If you're having a one bowl week tomorrow, but I am flying home to watch the SMU game and go pull for the ponies and see how they do. Sure, full. I was just going to say, I, I swear Markel Martin's been everywhere tonight. <laughs> We've seen him good and bad. in the running game. We've seen him all over the place in the past. You to know if you're Justin Jett. But Nick Foles is on his way out of bounds. And he's not getting any more yards moving up forward. And it's a scary thing for Nick Foles. This time he's just going to throw it away as he was being pressured. Nigel Nicholas was back, seemed to pick it right off the carpet. Nick Foles wasn't able to throw that last play, wasn't able to get it out of bounds before stepping out of bounds, so it counted as a sack. Mm -hmm. But guys, we've seen Oklahoma State up the game. You're saying, well, it's a blowout by Oklahoma State. The problem for Arizona hasn't been effort. Mm -hmm. I think they've shown a lot of resiliency at different times so far in this first half. I think execution's been a big problem. Uh, the, the botched punt return. Yeah. You know, they had stopped Oklahoma State, and then they went down and scored. Well, the Jerron got his hands underneath, but the replay official did not. So a little over three minutes on the review as you take another look at it. Right here, both. But maybe it, it, maybe it, it doesn't but fall that's under it. It's not indisputable. I mean, uh, I don't know how you get a clear, clear cut shot too serious to go. They come up with a completion now. Bowles gets his snap quickly again into the middle. Kreiner's the lone receiver at the top of your screen. Bowles right. What talking about now? Bowles looking for Travis Cobbs and contact out there and a catch by Cobb and a flag comes down. Now Cobb put his hands on the defensive back. He was working on Devin Hedgepath. Let's see which way the call's gonna go here as Cobb stepped in and made the grab. That was, regardless, that was an unbelievable Good catch. catch. It's the second time somebody on Arizona has made a one-handed stab on a ball. See who's get the hands on it. First hand. Yeah, you know yeah, what? He did. It's a good yeah. call. Yeah. Good call. It, it's a good call. Yep. Yeah. Sure enough. Grabbed him in the back of the numbers and pulled.